Being a pastor may have been the scariest thing I had ever thought about doing. When I was in school, I'd always wanted to be a physician, I wanted to be a doctor. I thought that was really what I should be doing in my life. I loved science. I loved the idea of being able to help people. I loved the opportunities that I thought medicine would give me. But then I started thinking that maybe God wanted me to do something different. That was scary. I hated English in school. And the idea of spending my life having to write a sermon, a composition every week was absolutely terrifying. I couldn't think of hardly anything else in life that I thought would be worse trying to do than to write a sermon every blooming week for the rest of my life. I didn't want to do that. But then I began to realize how much God had done for me, how much I um, love God. So I began to look into the possibility of going into ministry. I changed my major in college, became uh, somebody with a biology degree in education, and then decided to go to seminary. Amazing thing was is that I began to realize that when I talked about God, there were lots of things that I had to say, lots of things that I wanted people to know about. In fact, over the years, talking about God and writing a sermon has become probably the greatest joy of my life. I get to be creative. I get to explore new ideas. I get to take some of the most complicated things in all of humanity and try to make them where people can understand them. It's fun. It's fulfilling. I get to do exciting things. I get to be with people during times of great joy. I get to perform weddings. I get to be with people during times of great grief. I share with them dream funerals. I've had opportunities to travel the world and opportunities to keep learning all along the way. In fact, I, for me, can't think of anything that would have fit me better and made my life more meaningful than to have spent it serving God and talking to people about how much God loves me and how much he's done for me. The sense of call is just something that uh, seemed to be within me. I don't think I can really explain it. It was more just a, a desire, a yearning, that I wanted to do something with my life that would make a difference for others and that they would find uh, value and joy and peace from God's love that I'd found. If this is what God lays on your heart, then you need to uh, not be afraid. You need to allow God to lead you and allow God to give you the gifts and the graces and the talents to do what he asks you to do. It's been a good life.